Hey you guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to turn off RTT calling on your iPhone. So if you don't know what RTT calling is, first and foremost, RTT stands for real time text. And this basically just helps people with hearing disabilities better communicate over the phone. It's essentially like closed caption or subtitles in real time. In the USA, um, RTT automatically comes enabled on your phone. And so if you want it off, you have to go in and disable it. However, on iPhones, you actually have to go into your settings in order to enable this feature and, and get it working. So if at some point you went in and enabled it and you forgot that it was enabled this whole time and you forgot how to go in and turn it back off, then I'm gonna cover all of this in this video. So the first thing we're gonna do is launch our settings. And then we're gonna scroll down and go into accessibility. And then you're going to scroll down um, until you find this option here, TTY. TTY stands for teletype. This is that real-time text, but it's referred to as this in our iPhone. And when you click on it here, you have two options, the software TTY and the hardware TTY. Um, now, if these were turned on, you'd have a bunch of different things enabled. However, once you get to this place here and you see that these are all toggled on, all you have to do is toggle off the software TTY and the hardware TTY. Once these are toggled off, this real-time text will be disabled on your phone. And then if ever you wanted to come back in and enable these again, like I said before, you would just toggle these two back on. I would like to mention if you know that the person you're calling does have a hearing issue, then it's probably best to leave this feature on. But like I said before, if you don't want to leave it on all the time, now you know how to go in and turn it on for that occasion. Alrighty, you guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope that all of this information was helpful and I will see you guys in the next one.